to choose this content for team of the year um, I'm not sure what to expect tonight looking at how the game is um, it's not like there's any SBCs everything's about all over the shop also we've been chipping away SBCs but there's no icons no uh, player SBCs just resets for all the various upgrades that we have um, oh, what's this? Team of the Year League's player pick. This is a earn one of three raid. Um, 86 overall or higher from all the leagues that have a um, Team of the Year basically. So this is 87 and higher. Team overall rate minimum 85. So be a bit of fun, but it feels a bit steep. That's the only thing. I'm a bit baffled, no SBCs, um, objectives, uh, let's have a look, year in review 3 is upon us, we got the title went in April for the first time in February for the year, North one got 2, scored 2 goals in 5 separate matches with a Serie A attacker, West Ham became conference league champion, scored 5 goals with an English mid, so that's one game, fans showed off a record breaking so scored 10 goals in squad so that's one game with six French players so you basically you can do that with one English mid, half a dozen French and your French can be from Serie A um, one of my clinched the Ballon d'Or in 2023 assist with a Liga F player so 1, 7, 8 um, basically 8 players because your France 14 and all can count for um, French. Same for Liga F actually, so yeah, you'd actually find you get Kubo for that, that is the objective group reward. Year in review completionist, obviously it's an 83 double and then an 84 5, so not too bad there. Team of Year Cup, I've been chipping away at, not been going to plan sadly. Been getting a lot of sweaty players in that game mode. Got our 11 games done for. Um, Rivals literally took us less than two hours. We literally used like that team that's on screen there. Um, literally just built a crappy bronze team, put it in, and it was done and dusted. So, the only thing for tonight is double plus pursuit. Take a center mid on a journey to earn two plus style pluses and a double weak foot upgrade. So, overall max 75, pace max 80, shooting max 74. Must not be an in progress evil. Position centre mid, number of play styles max 7, number of play styles max 0, unlock within 20 days, expire in 27. Or if you want in simple terms, 3 weeks, 4 weeks. So, win 3, assist 5, play 2, assist 3, so nice and straightforward. What I will try and do with the 2 games to play is say to my opponent, can I get 3 assists with who I'm doing, um, get the win for yourself, um, that's like on me. And then next part is play two, win one, assist two. So I'll just do the play two um, naturally, and then win one with getting two assists with an evil player like for like so. Akpa Ak Pro um, looks quite juicy. Eighty three pace, eighty shot, eighty four pass, ninety dribbling, eighty three defending, and eighty seven physical. Obviously, the in progress looks encouraging, and then you see that boost. It is just pretty juicy um, let's find an example a good example of players uh, Val Hennep may actually be a very good example uh, until he sees pace no, so it needs to be somebody a wee bit quicker um, do we have somebody that's like 75 pace oh, um, Kuro would have been until he's seen his pace Jackson Irvin we'll use Mitchell. Mitchell is a good kind of like ish example like 82 um, pace like what you're needing is something that's like an 80 plus club card really um, by the time they get all the boosts like the higher the pace really you, um, you're on the money is what I would say um, Billy Gilmore just lacking Schmid lacking mainly defensive physicals um, Triori like, could he eventually become half decent? Mm, yes, I know. Like, this is when it's good when you started packing stuff. You can actually kind of look over a few players. Oh, Michael Meza. Um, 
he probably needs at least another evil arm to be half decent. Um, but 76 pace, 80 shot and pass, 82 dribbling, 74 defending, 86 physical. He becomes, I would say if there's any other evils that you put on him that don't incorporate playstyle plus, he's got a chance but you would need to make sure he's not 75 rated by that point. So like high visibility on him, for example, could make him um, quite appealing. Claudio Falcao could be some more example. Um, if you've done um, like any of the playstyle pluses on him, uh, non playstyle plus evils, like uh, because like, with a bit of time he would actually become quite half decent. At the moment, anyways, we will go to who we are considering. So our shouts really are um, when we get to Hibs, position centre mid. So we've got options of Campbell or Doyle Hayes. Now the thing is there's three midfield evils for us that apply. One will get Levitt, one will get Campbell, one will get Doyle Hayes. So I'm thinking that um, Campbell maybe gets this, puts him as an 81 rated. Um, yes it's probably then going to cap him out um, with Incisive pass plus and relentless plus, but I think um, I'm gonna have a right good look. I'm not rushing to do the evils just now um, because at the moment, evil wise, we are of the mindset um, we'd like to wait mainly because of like Wing Wizard. Um, I think gets given hopefully for Mal Weedle when he comes. Marcondes could easily get this as well. Marcondes could actually be class. Um, do I have a mark on this actually? I think he's like 70 or 69, 70 raid. I've maybe not packed him yet. With all these silver packs. And nah, pity. Let me have a look. Marco, I might have to. Mark on this. Yeah, 70 raid, so I've not got him. Right, that's fine. I'll have a look on foot GG for him. Because Wing Wizard be able to do for my leader. Um, but we'll get a look and see where we go for there because at the moment we're thinking team of the year visionary fast forward might sneak in for us because I think one of the players that's coming um, for Hibs could get this card um, so that could be more coins to spend so we could end up spending two seven, uh, 175 here um, 250, 325 would be spending like 425k and I'm starting to trade a wee bit again so we'll wait and see um, the only question is does the hips player that comes in the defence come in within four days and at the game um, I think in fact I'll be able to check I'm sure it's for Bournemouth so if it will oh he's not actually in the game interesting I think I'm sure it's Bournemouth he was coming from Bevan I'll put him into this I mean he might not be at um, Owen Bevan there we go oh he's not actually got a card type Never mind. Yeah, so he's in the system but not got a card or whatever, or a game face and all that kind of stuff, but hey ho. Um, so yeah, nothing to really excite us about sadly tonight, but let us know uh, who you're going to do with all the respective evils and all that good stuff. So have a good one folks, take it easy all, thanks for watching and I'll catch you all later.